Ooh. Now I'm listening. That is gonna have to stop. Oh, you think this is annoying? Mm. Try listening to you and Bonnie bicker every five minutes. So you've been following us? Of course I have. <laughs> you were the closest thing I have to a TV. I mean, you're no Baywatch, but remember Baywatch? No, I do not. Oh, oh man, you gotta watch it. You like lifeguards, like hot ones? This has been a monumentally bad day and a sea of bad days, so I'm gonna need to know who you are, what you're doing here, and how it relates to me, or I'm gonna rip your throat out. Temper's gonna get you in trouble, Damon. It's already driven Bonnie away how many times? Oh, 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 wait, I know, 13. I know, I'm chatty. <laughs> Sorry. My name's a kid, Malachi. It's like they expected me to be evil. All these kids were murdered. Hello? Not everyone died? I had a soft spot for one of my sisters. So otherwise, I would have cut her lungs out, and not just her spleen. What? You can survive without a spleen. Because I will kill Kai and anyone who comes in the way of me going home. I heard my name. All good, I hope. You know, you could have just shown us the Ascendant to begin with. Yeah, but I wanted to fill your hand on my chest. OK. OK, sorry. Seriously. I'm just kind of rusty on the face-to-face -face type human interactions. You ever worn skinny jeans? Ah, it seems wrong. All bunched up. Also, why are jeans so tight when the phones are so big? Yeah, I don't know what to tell you, pal. Oh, God. I'm that guy, right? That guy that won't shut up. Oh, I hate that guy. Ooh, I forgot how massive this house was. Oh, yum, cupcakes. You on Twitter? Ah. I just signed up, you should follow me. You were always so bad at hide and seek. I mean, you were four. But still, find a better hiding spot. Why would we help you, Kai? Well, in case you haven't figured it out by now, I'm a sociopath. I know, shocker. I like being a sociopath, you know? I'm not burdened by things like guilt or love. So then this merge happened with my brother Luke, and I won, which was great, because I absorbed his ability to do magic. But now I can't stop thinking about how Luke died. Now Liv's life is, is ruined for some horrible reason I can't shake. How badly I feel about it. <laughs> you feel bad? Yeah, so when I absorbed Luke's magic, I must have gotten some of his qualities or something like empathy. So I Googled how to process emotional pain. And, and they said, if you, if you write everything down in a letter and burn it, you'll be healed. So I started writing and this water literally started pooling in my eyes. Has that ever happened to you? Like, like water just, just oozing out of my eyeballs like I'm some alien creature excreting fluids. You mean you cried? Yes. Have you flown recently? There's also the whole, the whole liquid situation and the, the stripping before you go through security thing. It's weird. Why am I here? Uh, well, I spent 18 years in abandoned restaurants and now I'm showing off the fruits of my labor. I don't mean the Mr. Grill. Oh, you mean like my cure here, Mystic Falls. <laughs> Sorry, I'm nervous. I'm you look really pretty. Why am I here, Kai? Well, I, uh, I took a spell that was keeping supernaturals out of Mystic Falls, and I, I like absorbed it, like, like ate it. I guess it's cool, huh? First, I eat magic, and then eventually I lose it. But I mean, a huge spell like that. I mean, come on, magic's oozing out of me. It's all over the place. You know, I didn't quite realize it was so out of control until I met the manager of the grill a few hours ago. And he was all like, yeah, you, you can't come in here. We're closed. And you, you have an unconscious girl all over your shoulder. And I was like, don't judge me. So then I gave him a heart attack. I tried to. But all I did was make him vomit uncontrollably, which was like, Ugh, all right, let's stop that. So I tried again. And I think I broke his spine. I mean, I'm not, I'm not really sure. Because the third time I tried the spell, he kind of exploded in blood. Whoops. What the hell is wrong with you? I just told you I have too much magic. You know, it wasn't until after my test run with the manager that I realized if I start to merge with Joe and my gushing fountains of magic turn her into that guy, then I'm not going to have a twin for the merge. So, Elena, that is why you are here. Because I need to get my magic under control by practicing with you, or rather, by practicing on you. Oh, APS hey, silver lining. 
After the manager finally stopped thrashing around, I finally managed a cloaking spell. Thank you. It's easy to do and undo. Fesmatos oculix. <laughs> Table for three. <laughs> you had no idea. <laughs> <laughs>